So we are taking three and a half months to travel from Belize to Panama. And our first destination, our first spot is Cape Cocker. As soon as we arrived here, we knew we would love it here. The bright colors, the smells, the sounds, it was just such a fun vibe. From the Rastafarian music and dreadlocks to the colors, it's just everything that you would hope for out of a Caribbean island. We, we picked Key Cocker as our first destination because we wanted a bit of a holiday, a bit of a relaxation time to start our trip off. There's something here for everyone. If you want to sit by the ocean and read a book, if you want nightlife and karaoke, there's that too. If you want to do excursions or rent a golf cart and go explore the north end of the island, there's that as well too. And also here on Southside, there's lots of fun things to do. The, one of the things the kids really liked doing was feeding tarpons. I really liked feeding the tarpon. Tarpon are really big fish that can live up to 100 years old and they can get to be 300 pounds and eight feet long. To feed them, you hold a sardine in between your thumb and finger, and you hold your hand flat like a foot above the water, and, and then they come, out, they come up and eat them right out of your hands. Oh, you scared me! William, farther away from the dock? Hey. That was a good one. Down a little more. <laughs> Which one will get bit first? Mom's or Avery's? <laughs> Avery's. <laughs> and a sardine flew up and hit Mom in the face. <laughs> <laughs> we also really enjoyed watching the sunset on the other side of the island and one of the hotels feeds the stingray right there and we loved watching the sunset and you can actually pet the stingrays they come right up over your feet and that was really fun and exciting for the kids I've never done anything like that <laughs> Whoa, they feel cool. There's not as much beach area as we thought there would be, but after being here for over a week, it doesn't feel like we missed out on that because there's so many great swimming spots, especially over by the split. There's even a high dive. One of our excursions, we chose to fly over the Blue Hole, and that was an experience that we weren't expecting. My family doesn't know this yet, but I just booked um, a plane to fly us over the Blue Hole. Uh, so they're swimming on the other side of the island right now, so I gotta go find them because it leaves in two hours. Hey guys! Yeah? Come here. I was almost guys. swept away to the alligators. Guys, today we're going to the blue hole in the plane. We are? Yep. Yeah. Where are we going? The blue hole. William and Jacob both want the front seat I'm with the pilot. Okay, sure. rock, paper, scissors. <laughs> Best of three. Battle it up. Oh, William's up front. <laughs> no, I heed this guy did. Oh, he did. Yeah, he won. <laughs> Excited? Yeah. Guys, you can find your seats there. Just slide yourselves right in. And feel free to put your back. This is kind of crazy. Getting in a plane on the wing. 
You got your pilot license? No. <laughs> Pilot even let William steer the plane, and I think that's something he's going to remember for the rest of his life. He was so happy. It was really cool and definitely probably going to be one of the top highlights for our kids for this trip. We were all so happy for William except for Jacob who was a little bit sour because he wanted to sit in the co-pilot seat as well. <laughs> William? No, you William, got the front. Congratulations. <laughs> you won rock, paper, scissors and you got to fly the plane. Okay. Jacob, how do you feel? I feel terrible and William's not allowed up here because he won. So get off here. The second excursion that we did was um, a snorkeling tour, and it was unreal. There is about a 50-50 chance we see manatees. That's what I'm really hoping. Hoping we can find the manatees. Manatees! Manatees. What are those? Wait, what do manatees look like? Manatees. What do manatees look like? Yeah, they're like a dolphin, but like a swoosh face. Oh yeah, those. We also went to Shark Ray Alley and I wasn't expecting the nurse sharks to all come swarm the boat as soon as you get there. Wow. And then you get in the water and watch them swim by you. It was really cool. Are you climbing in the shark water?
The turtle I liked and he swam right up to the water and back down. There was also a sunken barge that you could uh, swim around and all the coral and things are growing on the barge that there's so much fish in and around the barge and you can even swim through it and explore it. Sunken barge. Sunken barge. What was your favorite band? Mine was the sharks. They were so friendly. If you were looking for a place to take like a week or ten day vacation, we would absolutely recommend Cake Ocker. It has something for everyone. It's relaxing for those who want to be beach bums. There's excursions for those who want to explore. There's nightlife for those who are into karaoke and live music. There's a little bit of something for everyone. There's palm trees and white sand. Even the roads are sand that you don't have to wear shoes the entire time you're here. So we absolutely loved our time here in Keycocker and would recommend it 100% if you're looking for a destination to go. Definitely put it on your list. Hey guys, we're going to be traveling for a very long time, so if you want to follow our families, hit the subscribe button and turn on your notifications. Boy! <laughs> <laughs> Do not put that in there. Yes. That was good. That was a good one.